Hey, what's up guys? So in this gameplay, we got ourselves a nice high kill solo game on Warzone. And I decided to try out a shotgun that I haven't tried out in a couple months. The shotgun I am talking about is of course the 725 shotgun. Now the last time I made a video about this shotgun, it was a few months ago and I made a best loadout video for it. And since we already did that, I decided to take some time out of this introduction to explain why this shotgun is so good for solo players. If you're playing duos, trios, or squads, don't use this shotgun. But if you're a solo player and you're looking for guns that you have not used before, or maybe you're looking for guns that that might cause somebody to spectate you for a little while then this is definitely your go-to gun although there's only two shots in the chamber at once all you really need is two shots so long as you get really close to the enemy and with it being solos you're only really ever in one-on-one -on -one gunfights so two shots is definitely enough so long as you can hit them now with the specific build that i used in this gameplay you really have to get very close to the enemy if you want both shots to kill the reason i use the shortest barrel is just because i like the way it looks and the run speed is amazing with the shortest barrel but if you're trying to actually increase your range for the shotgun i would recommend the middle barrel or the tempest smooth barrel so what you guys are seeing on screen now are the attachments i was using on the 725 shotgun so for starters it was the monolithic suppressor the sawed off barrel the five milliwatt laser the sawed off stock and also the sleight of hand perk i dubbed this build the pirate shotgun because it reminds me a lot of those old school shotguns you see in the pirate movies i guess one of the biggest reasons as to why i would recommend using this in solos is just for the wow factor like i said said before everyone always gets shocked that they got killed by a 725 and people will spectate you people will send you messages saying why are you using that or is it really that good and all in all it's just a load of fun to use this thing in warzone that's basically all i have to say about this gameplay just as a reminder we are on the road to 10k subs so if you like the video and like warzone feel free to subscribe as always thank you guys for watching the gameplay and hope you guys do enjoy the video i still have a lot more fun on cold wars multi than in this game so that's for sure I guess we walked right past that kid. Who's he even? Was he? Was he shooting at no one? I'm pretty sure he was shooting thinking that I was in the direction he was shooting in and wasn't shooting at anyone. Or that's the guy. Two roof kids. I am just gonna run and hopefully we don't get shot in the back. Let's just go push somebody that's not on the roof of Superstar. Like these two guys over here to our right. jump was that enemy UAV 
All right. I don't know why my guy jumped like that. That was a weird jump. Swapped out the P90? Yeah, I did. Not because we were doing bad with the P90, but just because the MP7's a little bit easier to use. And we've been doing this 725 for like three days now, and I just want to get the gameplay. <laughs> so I switched to the, the MP7. I figured we'd have better chances of getting the good gameplay with a little bit better of a primary. But a bit more versatile. Yeah, it has a lot. It's a lot easier to control at range too. And as I think it does better damage output, like a faster time to kill or something. I'm not sure though. big mistake you always throw the what out right when you buy it always yes i did charles Why did he go back? Be advised, UAV is being over you. Uh, there is two people like over here i think i mean it's probably just one now but we can go back over there and look i'm pretty sure yeah it was by the buy station i think it could have been these houses i'm not i can't remember exactly but we can go back and check see if we can find them and it's our bounty now so Uh, Silver Gamer, I think we're the follow by the way, dude. Thing with stopping power rounds is so funny dude <laughs> it's so funny but all right guys we got this we got a good game in our hands hopefully we don't get third party hopefully We really go back to Boneyard. Wait, he just disappeared. What? Well, he either got killed by somebody with ghosts or something. He must have found his ghost perk. Or his ghost class must have been there. the train i think that might have been him i don't know though it kind of looked like there was but his red dot's not there anymore i think that might have been him oh, this is 
bad. That was dumb. That was dumb. Go back. Go back. Maybe he'll push. Good day, sir. I said good day. Danger Davis. Good day, Danger Davis. Hopefully no one's on this roof. I really hope no one's on this roof. I probably should have taken the interior uh, zip line just to play it safe. Alright, so bounty guy's under us. I was really hoping I wouldn't miss both shots. You know, that guy that was there on the map, he could have been landing in the whole time. I don't know though. I still should be cautious. He either left or maybe he was just landing in. This one straggler though is looking looking nice. There's three people there though. Okay, okay, we'll go for the straggler and then we'll go back. Because there shouldn't be three whole people there when we go back. Uh, what's up, LSU? Yeah, again, Mike Breezy, thank you for the raid, dude. And somebody with ghost killed him. about is we don't have a, a trophy this guy jumped out of the tower oh we got blue warehouse kid I didn't know he was right there. GG's. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. I didn't know he was right there. I should have left the house without knowing where he was. Hopefully win the gulag. Sounds like somebody else is up there shooting, but I guess not. We'll sit here. He's going to have to jump off any second and we can probably get him while he parachutes. He already parachuted. Shit, dude, the guy up there is a sniper. Why does everybody have snipers? <laughs> At least we know he's not up there anymore. He jumped off. Enemy 
my god, we're out of ammo, dude. Oh my god. We're out of fucking ammo. <laughs> we don't even have AR ammo. I mean, he's got to jump down in like 10 seconds. But we're going to have to hit like every shot. This isn't looking good for us at all. Circle is not in our favor. Does she not have any small ammo? You got this. Ah, GG's, dude. Five, Let me try our best. Let me try our best. 